The first type of control that we'll discuss is an administrative control. Administrative controls are upfront design-based controls, and they involve things such as site selection of your facility, the design of your facility, and the configuration of your facility. Now, all these factors play a role in the overall security of a physical location. For an example, have you ever wondered why many high-performance aircraft are tested? A lot of the design work is done in the desert southwest of the United States. The reason behind that is it provides a high level of security. It provides security for the flight crew. If there is an in-flight emergency, there's a much better chance of getting on the ground in that particular area of the country because it's flat. You have a better chance of landing with some problem than if there's a lot of hills around. Likewise, for the security of the project, it may be a very good idea to keep all the visual elements of that project away from prying eyes. So being in a remote area kind of helps the security of the project a great deal. The isolation as well. If all of the people who are working on a secret project are isolated from the rest of the world for the period of time they're working on the project, there's a lower probability that social engineering attacks can occur and that information leaks can occur. So all of these reasons are pulled together for the security of a project, the site selection and the design of the facility as well as how it's set up makes a huge impact. Now a facility of any type can be more secure by selecting a more secure site. So basically what you want to do is if you need to increase the security, you may need to look at a more secure location or more secure area. If you are unable to move, then you might just want to reconfigure the facility where you currently reside. If you have the ability to design your own facility, the design of that facility should take security concerns into account from the very beginning. Make sure that security is on the agenda from the very beginning of your design meetings. And that way you'll have a facility which is far more secure than just trying to secure it after the fact.